Good morning, everybody. Welcome back to White Out Take Two. My name is Kobajo. Last episode, we gathered ourselves up a deer. Ooh, that's gotta hurt. Gathered ourselves up a deer. Um, looted some of the fishing villages, or fishing huts, and um, made our way to some of the buildings on the outskirts. And this is where we're gonna start our more combat boots, interesting. This is where we're gonna start today. We ended up calling the episode here last time. Um, we wanna loot this area. Um, let's pull out a flare. Might as well. I want some light in here. Um, so we're gonna start looting here. We got three buildings over here to loot. Uh, at least I think it's, I think it's three. I'm gonna check these three buildings out. Um, already we found some good food. Um, I don't care for some of the stuff that we picked up though. Uh, like these combat boots. I'm not, I already have a pair of combat boots. We can leave those. Uh, what else did we grab? The food is fine. We have so much meat on us that we're gonna need to cook up as soon as we get back. The food can stay. That can stay. Oh, I do have torches. I didn't need to burn that, that, uh, Flare. Oh well. Um, yeah, those combat boots can stay. Is there anything else I wanted to drop while I'm here? Let's see, keep the accelerant. Keep the wood. Any clothes? Oh, what about this ski jacket? One ski jacket, decent ski jacket. Oh, buy a ski jacket. Um, so yeah, so we have a couple of buildings to search here. You can see there's my footprints. It is early morning. We are stinky. We've got the meats. Mountaineering rope. No, not for 11 pounds. Sorry, guy. So much wood over here to break down as well. Let's see if there's anything. I don't think... I'm pretty sure we already checked out these areas behind to see if there's anything over here. I don't think there was, but I want to give it another quick once over. So yeah, so the plan for today, we're going to loot, at least start looting these areas. Um, see if there's anything here that we might find useful. Another accelerant. And then uh, make ourselves another accelerant. Jeez. Make our way back to Quonset to drop off. And after that, I don't know. We'll figure that out. One step at a time. Get up. All right. And our last building here. These are smaller, so... We're gonna have to drop off some of these, uh... Man, so many sewing kits. We're gonna have to drop off some of these, uh, matches as well. Just unnecessary weight. Drink that herbal tea, even though it's cold. We are pretty encumbered. Wonder what our weight is looking like. Woo! That's a big and 113 pounds. Anything good in the backpack? Just some more food. We got plenty of food now. Um, we shouldn't have to worry about um, losing well rested. Oh, sorry, well fed. And there's another fishing hut over there, too. We're gonna have to come back for that fishing hut. We really want to get home and, uh... Drop off. We really want to drop off this, uh... This meat. And the rest of our supplies. Because, uh... The meat's gonna attract the wolves, and then, uh... Yeah, this encumbrance is just... It makes us move so slow. We're not even going to bother picking up sticks. I lied. Yes, we are.
Okay, but that's all we're doing. We're just breaking to pick up the sticks. And then, uh... We're coming. We're gonna go uh, drop off the rest of our stuff now. Make our way back to uh, Quonset. Where we can unload, regain some... Sanity for carrying a hundred pounds on our person. I don't think we looted this car, so we're gonna check this car out. Actually, I remember one time I was playing this game. Ragged fleece cowl. I'm probably gonna drop that off. Remember one time I was playing this game, and I went to this car and I found a heavy hammer. What's that? Oh, another firearm cleaning kit. And I found a, a heavy hammer in this car. So... I was hoping this car was gonna have something good in it, but... I hear you. Alright, let us, um, drop that off. Actually, you know what? We can just harvest this. That'll give us enough time for the wolf to go away. And then we'll also, um, eat. Hopefully the wolf went away, and we are back on our trek. <clears throat> oh, no, the wolf's still here. Alright, guy. How much meat do you have? 12 pounds? Alright. Let's, uh, reload. Back on our merry way. He took that one shot and and stayed up. Very interesting. Now as long as a bear doesn't find us, we'll be pretty okay. I don't think the bears are on this side though. I think they're closer to Quonset. But we want to keep an eye out for a bear. Because we won't be able to outmaneuver them. And I don't think we can kill a, a bear with this revolver. Even in, you know, six shots, I don't think a bear is going down. And I still need to find that rifle, though. We've got plenty of time. I think we're doing very well. I think we're doing very well for our attempt. Oh no! Well, that's not good. I wasn't watching my hunger. Because I was just thinking, I was like, we're going to eat whenever we get home. Like, no big deal. Like, we'll just plop some food. I have plenty of food on me. And like a chump, I wasn't watching my food or my water or anything. And I was kind of going through. And like a chump, we lost well fed. As if our movement speed wasn't slow enough as is. I can see home all the way over there, though. We're so close. I wonder if I can just... I'm real tempted to just energy drink here.
Oh, I'm such a chump. I'm so mad now. Ah! Okay, uh, bandage. I just want to get to a safe spot. Start a fire. I don't know where that bear is. What a garbo day, man. There he is. Yeah, he would have got us. I didn't think the bears were out this far. I thought once we made it past the under arch over there, we would have been safe from the bears, but is he eating my food? Man, if that deer meat is all gone by the time we get back, I'm gonna be so mad. I don't think he'll take all of it. I think he might take one or two pieces. Man, I do not play well with bears, huh? All right. Over here. No, over here is where I want to go. This is what we're going to do. Drop that. All right, let's come over here. We're going to have to drop. We're dropping so much stuff. Drop all. Drop all. Drop. Cancel. We need to lose some weight.
and let's eat. gonna organize all this stuff later all right now what I really want to do what I really want to do is go out and get the rest of that meat time is it? It's almost night time. I really want to go get the rest of that meat. I think I shot that bear a couple of times. If I remember correctly, storing food outside in a container is makes it last longer than storing it inside in a container. can we drop for weight we'll get a fire going to warm up a little bit we'll get the warming up bonus from a tea um and then we will, if we can actually start a fire. And then we'll go try and get the rest of that meat before that bear gets to it. Man, what started off as an awesome day has just turned into not a great day. Dude, how hard is it to start a fire? Is there a reason? Like, is there some reason I can't start a fire? Like, do I have some condition that says you don't know how to start a fire? Maybe there's just too much charcoal. I don't know where charcoal goes. I don't use charcoal. Let's try it again. Now that there's no charcoal in here, maybe this works now. Maybe there's just too much charcoal on a fire, it won't start. I don't know.
Finally. We'll make a tea. While that's going on, I want to organize my fire supplies. I'm going to put books over here, and then we've got all that. And all that. Boom. Grab our tea. Drink. We're now nice and warm. Take a tea with us. Pull out our rifle, or our revolver. And we're gonna go out and hit up the, hopefully recover the meat that we dropped over by that bear. Hopefully that bear is gone by now. Oh, uh, don't tell me it's gonna start. Now you're gonna start to blizzard? There's the wolf that we killed. There's our fire. All right. There's a moose now. Oh, we're going to have fun. We're going to get that moose. It's going to take us all our revolver ammo, but we're going to get that moose. Man, I just wish we had a rifle. It'd be so fun hunting that moose with a rifle. So it looks like we have 18 pounds of meat left. I don't know what happened to the rest of it. I think some of it was down by where that bear actually dropped us because I didn't pick it up. Ah, uh, that's annoying. Um, I kind of want to go back and go get it though. Man, and then there's that moose. The wildlife is starting to get crazy. I just really wish we had a... I just really wish we had a, a rifle. That's all I wish. It'd be really nice if we could have a rifle. All right, let's take a look at our stats, and then I think we're going to call it a day here. Tomorrow, we're going to have to go get that rifle, or that um, meat that we dropped. I can't believe we lost well-fed. We lost everything. Oh, man, what a what a garbage day. Um, well, almost 12 days of food, and, don't, and that doesn't count for the, um, meat that we have outside. Almost 20 days of hardwood, softwood, we need the reclaimed wood, 
We've got plenty of sticks. We've got plenty of tinder. We're going to need a couple more bandages. We've got plenty of matches. We still need the rifle. We have the hatchet. I need the lamp oil. And... We have the rifle cartridge. Really? So we need the lantern oil? The rifle? I think we can finish up our food. And we need the reclaimed wood, which there's plenty around outside of uh, Quonset. So... If we can just get that rifle and the uh, and the uh, lantern oil, we'll be pretty okay. And if we need to, we can go fishing. I really don't want to, uh, but we can. We'll drop that off so we can get that going. Let's take a look at where that moose is. Where does he like to sit? We saw him over there. Hear you. Two point seven days. So it doesn't even need to be cooked food. Okay. Back in the trunk you're gonna go. I guess I have to go from the other side. I think it stays for better here. All right, guys, I think that's going to do it for this episode. Um, I think come nighttime or until nighttime, I'm just going to break down some clothes, uh, repair up what we got damaged from the uh, from the bear attack, break down some of these clothes, um, get some sleep in. Uh, we're just going to organize some stuff, probably put the food away, uh, drop off some of this water that we have. And, uh, and that's about it. So thank you guys so much for watching. I really do appreciate it. Um, we should be able to recover our condition. I'll drink a tea before bed. Uh, we should be able to recover our condition, um, while we sleep. Shouldn't be a huge deal. And then, uh, we'll go out tomorrow, get the meat that we dropped and, um, break out some of the pallets. Uh, get some of the pallets broken down around here, get organized, yada, 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 and we'll continue from there. Uh, thank you guys so much for watching. I really do appreciate it. If you liked the video, please don't forget to hit that like button. It helps me out a lot. Also, as well, if you guys are looking for more content, the subscribe button right down below would be awesome. Uh, really do appreciate it, guys. Thank you so much. And until next time, guys, I will see you.